So what about this movie camera that Sackfolk have been raving about on all the forums lately? Well, apparently, it's quite similar to the game camera, but is more suited to the movies you'd make within your level. It, too, can be set to follow the player, if you wish. Designating its target type to cart will have it track the player, while switching the target type to gadget will keep the camera firmly fixed in position. Angle and zoom are, as you expect, in the tweak menu. Here, the view will be displayed with letterboxing, like a foreign cowboy movie from the 1970s. It has a rather useful input, which, when triggered automatically, switches it on, as well as an output that sends out a signal once its hold time has been reached. Hold time? That's the amount of time the camera will be active before turning off. You can even make use of a sequencer along with your movie camera, which allows for total control of your movies for optimum cinematic thrills, spills and yikes factor. Maybe your movie is going to be shown as a pre or post race taster for your level. If so, you'll need to hook up the sequencer to the scoreboard so that the movie will play before or after the level starts. It's easily done. Say you want it shown as a pre-race movie. Connect the scoreboard's pre-race output to the movie camera's input. This will turn the camera on when the level starts. Finally, connect the camera's output to the scoreboard's pre-race input and it will tell the scoreboard that the movie has ended and the 3, 2, 1 countdown will begin. Oh, you'd better stock up on popcorn, nachos, sweets and drinks so you can charge a small fortune for them, just like in the real movie theatres.